This lock doesn't look as murky as most of the fresh water I fish in, so I can't pass up the opportunity to see for myself what lives below the surface of the world's most mysterious lake. The water is translucent, but stained dark the color of tea by peat washed down from the bogs that smother the surrounding mountains. The deeper I go, the darker it becomes, until it is literally pitch black. This water, very, very interesting. Close in, you can see the bottom. There's this illusion of clarity. But if you follow the bottom out, it's, there's a sudden shoulder and it just plunges down into deep water. And you look out there and it's just black. And it's not silt, it's this staining that the water's got. Uh, it just eats up the light. It's impossible to see if there is a monster in here or not. Often my quest for monsters takes me to the other side of the world. Loch Ness is virtually on my doorstep. But has that made me underestimate what could be stalking its vast, dark waters? Out in the depths, there could be something the size of a submarine. You just wouldn't see it. It's really, really quite spooky. And it's also pretty cold, and I'm looking forward to getting out. If there is a giant creature in this water, then it has to be capable of hunting in the inky darkness, maybe more than 700 feet down. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like the River Monsters page.